right, hello everyone. Good morning, this is Anne Marie of The Art of Healing. It is Friday, September 10th. I am all aglow, look at me, I'm lopsided. I am all aglow because I'm just, I put oils on my skin, you know, and I don't have time to fuss with makeup today. I just, I, I'm like so busting with energy that I've gotta just get this video out of me. Um, so tomorrow is the 11th at 3 p.m. That's my personal energy course, uh, personal energy communications course. I'm still plugging it. Um, it's super duper awesome. And in honor of my personal energy course, I bought two new pendulums. I wanna share them with you. The tags are still on them. One is a copper one. Isn't it kinda cool? It's pretty fancy. Yeah. And then this one's really special. It's like all oh, amethyst. Isn't that fancy? Oh my God, it's so fancy. I'm excited about my course. And it's something I use every single day. Every single day. So anyway, I'm excited. Yay for those of you who have signed up. We're gonna have a great class. Woo, woo, woo. Okay, so the last video that I did, I shared with, the last video that I did, I shared with everybody a personal situation, right? Uh, and are we still recording? I hope so. Are we still recording? <laughs> okay, so I don't know what's going on. It's that kind of day. You roll with the punches. Okay, so as I was saying in my last video, um, I shared a personal experience and then I shared the channeled writing that came after it. Well, the other day I had another profound experience that I wanted to share with you. Um, I have a, a, a person in my life, a new person in my life that I'm excited about. And um, we were, he was supposed to come over and um, he hadn't shown up yet. And it wasn't like he was late, um, but he just like didn't communicate like, oh, I'm on my way or anything like that. So my ego mind went berserk, just went berserk. And I'm getting anxious and I'm pacing and I'm looking at the window. Why is he not here? Why is he not here? Blah, 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 blah. So I was like, whoa, okay, I need to check this out. I need to figure out what this is all about. So I sat down and again, I have my book with me. I actually wrote it on this book that I just grabbed because it was like that urgent. And I wanna read it to you. Okay, so my questions to myself were, what am I feeling right now and why am I feeling it? Those were my questions. And my response was, what am I feeling? Potential abandonment, disappointment, fear of rejection, unworthiness, huge, huge for me, unworthiness. Wow, that has traveled lifetimes with me. And loneliness, right? So abandonment, rejection, disappointment, unworthiness, and loneliness. And then this is my channeled response, the channeled writing. These are all memories of a bygone day. You choose to remember these feelings of lack. You have been given no indication that all these fears will manifest. You create them. They are not real. Just as you apply the, quote, living in joy principle, unquote, to your dealings with the external world, you must apply them to your personal life. It is the only way to proceed. Your expectation creates a vacuum that fills with memories of fear. Your ego mind only wishes the misery loves company principle and is there to bring you 
into dualism. <clears throat> your higher mind, your God spark, reminds you you are love, made from it, filled with it, and capable of limitless flow. Allow that vacuum of anticipation to be filled with that love, that remembrance of your true self and turn off the sad voice of ego. So that was the channeled response to my situation. And we ended up having a marvelous day. It was beautiful, completely true. And I just wanted to share that with all of you out there. <sighs> Ascension, what an amazing process. And what a joy it is to be alive. How incredible it is to experience the greatest show in the universe. We are so, we are so, I mean, blessed isn't even the word. We have to take this as being that we are the best of the best, the strongest of the strong, to be here during these times, to navigate these energies and to be front and center for the ascension of our planet. That's my personal message. Does Spirit have anything to say? Well, we can always pop in and say hello. <laughs> we are the Rock Collective. We are Anne Marie's guides and teachers. You still have difficulty understanding who you truly are. After all this time, after all the advice, after all the reassurances, you still place your trust in the ego. You still place your trust in the external. And you're not looking fully into the interior, into the oneness that you are with the one infinite creator. Please do this before you think anything else, before your ego mind has a millisecond to invent a problem for you. Go inside and find that connection to oneness. And when that connection to oneness fills who you are, you cannot see anything but love in front of you. That is our wish for you, dear humanity. That is our wish for you. We are Ra. We are the Ra Collective and we love you. <laughs> Thank you, Ra. Thank you, everyone. Thanks for spending a few minutes with me and putting up with my shiny, oily skin and the issues with technology. Namaste, everyone. Be blessed. Be well. Live in joy. I love you.